Hi, it's Shelly from Best Buy's Plug-in Blog, and today we're trying out the Sphericator. The Sphericator is the only automatic caviar and pearl maker. So it's, you can basically make pearls out of anything, and I'll show you what I mean by making pearls. In this bowl we have coffee, and over here we have hot chocolate. Um, what I've done is I've brewed the coffee and the hot chocolate separately, and I added sodium alginate to each of them. It comes included with the Sphericator package. Um, basically, sodi sodium alginate is a thickener. So we've left this sit for 45 minutes each, and now we're going to try to put it through the Sphericator. To turn the coffee and the hot chocolate into pearls, I have to add one liter of water, and three tablespoons of calcium chloride. So I add the calcium to the water and I'm just going to stir it to dissolve. You can see it's cloudy. I've got to add the coffee to the spiricator. You're only supposed to fill it up about halfway. Put the lid on. and hopefully start dropping pearls into the calcium water bath. I'm just gonna adjust the speed because some of them don't look like pearls. And you just keep going until all of the coffee is out of the spiricator. You can move it up and down and adjust the speed on the control over here to change the way that the pearls come out. It's really a learning curve. And as you can see, one cup of coffee, it's approximately 10 ounces of coffee, make a lot of pearls. Okay, next we're going to take the pearls out with a strainer. I would recommend using a smaller strainer. This is the only one I have. Putting them in another bowl. Take out a few more. Next I have to rinse them under water. So I've rinsed my pearls and uh, what I actually recommend you do is you just let the strainer sit on top of your bowl of calcium just to get excess water off. And now I'm going to scoop my pearls. They've congealed a little bit but you can actually pull them apart and see. And put it on top of ice cream because what goes better on ice cream than coffee? And we'll give it a try. I'll try to give it a try. Oh my god, it's so good. Um, when you're done using the Sphericator, it's really easy to clean. All you do is pop off the top, take the this part and rinse it out with water, and uh, you're supposed to actually plug it in near your sink, and I don't have a plug-in over there, otherwise I'd show you, but you're supposed to plug it in near your sink, and turn it on, and let the water run through, and then it's completely clean. Overall, I think the Sphericator is a really cool toy for the kitchen. Um, if you want to make anything into pearls, you can. Um, you can check out my full review of the Sphericator on Best Buy's plug-in blog. Thanks for watching.